All right, everybody, I hope you guys are excited for this video. We got a pretty awesome one for you today. So we're over here at Joe's over at the Compo Connection. I'll show you what he's doing right now. He's setting up some stuff outside. Sarah's not with me today. It is a Friday morning. What's up? Not much. Need some help? Yeah, untangling that down there. This thing is all tangled up, Joe. Yeah, I just keep shaking. Good morning, Elvis. <laughs> Good boy. Hope you find a lot of cool comics today, Angelo. Oh, thanks, Elvis. So the tents aren't set up right now, but these are usually where all the 50 centers are at. Daredevil, Silver Surfer, Avengers. Lots of $2 comics. Yeah, well, that's what we're bringing out here. Yeah, we got $2 Flash over here. I think it's some modern stuff. 137 Ooh, maybe these would be pretty cool. This box is jam-packed. Expecting a lot of people on Friday? Not really. No? Never done Friday before, so... Well, yeah, we did the first time you did a show. We, we, it was all uh, dealers. Yeah, well, that was years ago. And you said you had someone coming with a collection maybe to look at, right? Yeah, that, that's not too long. Well, back in the 90s and 2000s, when I bought collections, they had them all. Every every title in a complete run. Now, you get one comic out of each title. <laughs> I want to check out that what? the shed you built. Oh, wow. Look, you guys got the shelves up. This is legit storage space right here. So this is where you guys are going to keep all your fill 50 centers. This is pretty awesome. Well, yeah, all the boxes over there, I've still got fill in that are down there. Now you got a lot of room inside of here. We'll have. Yeah. See, that's all that stuff would be gone. So you'll have his workstation back. Are right, you gonna help me? Let's load up that wagon. I gotta get me one of these carts. Fit a lot of comics on there. Yeah, you can put three more in what we normally do. Not that I care if they get ran over, but I'm trying to be nice. <laughs> <laughs> well, here we go, people coming already. Yeah, I hate that. I still gotta put up the wall. Oh, comic books, huh? Yeah, that's all, no tools. Oh yeah. Well, usually we do a big show, four giant tents, but we're just doing the key stuff this time. Right, just right. See. Yeah, I'm on my way to work. I'm like a barn sale. Let me check that out. <laughs> yeah, different kind of barn sale, though. Yeah, right, right. <laughs> I got ASM. It's only 8 o'clock, so we're good. This one's cool right here. Angel, Issue 410. I want you to do me a favor and go ahead and put them in categories. Because I got another stack that big of keys coming out, plus all the graded ones. This is a nice little bundle here. 75 bucks. You get 430 and 431. Yeah, I had to talk a minute about it. Some Avengers. It's got an E on it. Yeah, that's one of mine, but... Uh, it's got an E on the label. See that E in the label? Yeah. That's that's Eddie's. Okay. And the M is Matt's. That's what I'm bringing out next. House of Mystery. Oh this is Matt's. Uh, so let's say put put the E. Put them all together in the mm -hmm. same area and put Matt's all right here. So we got Superman. He's got two of them here. Well, one of them signed, but. Yeah. CGC's done. Written on cover in marker. And this one has some really nice stuff. There's some Flintstones. Yeah, Batman. But he does have this one right here, 657. Really solid copy for 20 bucks. And then we do have Amazing Spider-Man 606. Beautiful J. Scott Campbell cover. Does have a couple of spine ticks. Not perfect, but there's some more Fantastic Four. Oh wow, these are clean Fantastic Four copies. Oh wow, these are nice. There's 44. That one's got a little staple issue. But that's a nice one right there. We got Thor with Hercules on Journey into Mystery 124. First appearance of Cassandra Kane, I think, on this one. Birds of Prey. Oh, this is an iconic cover. More Fantastic Four. Diablo. Is that the first appearance of Diablo? On issue 30? You have the Hell Arisen first punchline, I think. Oh, this is a great one right now. 666. Ooh. And here is the one everybody's looking for. 655. Batman Adventures Annual. You got the anniversary on Brave and the Bold. Oh, here's the other one. So they have like the whole set. 656 all the way through. I might have to come home with that. We'll see. Last of Us. Is this from uh i don't know what this is from american dreams naughty dog issue four of four maybe this is like a limited series they did oh this is a sick cover 25 bucks on journey into mystery wow that thing's really nice 125 look at the colors very bright colors wow silver surfer 17 for 35 bucks we have star wars oh that's a great cover on 107 1986 some more silver surfer this is one of those thicker issues absorbing man in titania that's pretty cool gang war 
with the Kingpin Daredevil. And then here's 359. So you got three copies of 359. Some more ASM over here. Let's see if we can find. Oh, this is a cool one here with Venom. $3 Batman boxes. We got some cool Batman books here. You got 705. A couple jock covers. This one's really cool too with Black Mask. You got this one right here with Upside Down Joker. Another great cover. That's issue 643. This one was really cool too. Did manage to find a few other cool ones. One of these is a little minor key. Gotta love Alex Ross. He had a great run. Coming up over here. Right here, look what I found for three bucks. Early appearance of uh, Harley Quinn. Definitely got some cool little keys hidden inside these boxes. This is another great one too. Such a great cover. And then I did find the uh, year three. Nice stuff right there. <laughs> The Thors, I just put those out. He actually just had those today. That one's nice, the um, 125. Yeah. Beautiful copy. And that one's good too. He does have the other one up here somewhere. I think he had a second one. Yeah, right here, the... Um, oh, that was the one I was looking at. The other Journey to Mystery. I think that one might be a little cleaner than that one, and it's funny, because that one's actually more expensive. <laughs> I remember okay, seeing one for 40 out there a little bit. <laughs> when I grabbed it off the wall, I was like, why is it 65 now? Yeah, this one's a lot nicer if you ask me too. Joe only has like one Flash comic right now. It's this one, issue 126. Ooh, there you go, Tales to Astonish. I love the World War II one. Almost forgot about all the Uncanny X-Men boxes. Usually it's just um, like issues from 300 and up. So let's see if maybe he filled in some new stuff. Ooh, it looks like we might get lucky. Bunch of these Jim Lee covers. This one's really cool right here. Whenever I see these, I always gotta pick them up. Really solid copies too. All the Jim Lee covers. Didn't get the uh, like the first one that he did. But for three bucks a piece, can't really beat it. And then six for 15. These are those $20 boxes that I didn't like the prices more, uh, and put on. So, buy one, get one free. Adventure Thank comics, you. so these are $20 a piece. What? Yeah, yeah, uh, get House I didn't of know Secrets. About this uh, the flea market. Just, the oh, these are cool here. No, I'm always looking. Oh, is that number one? Oh my God, it is. That's number two. Not the same thing. Ooh, yeah. Witching Hour number two. That's pretty cool. Nice stack of books Brian's right there. school teacher, so he can't do it on, telling you, man. on Fridays. I guess I have to save up for gas money because this is getting crazy. <laughs> I saw your channel, so I've been, I've been watching you guys. You guys have been doing a good job. Thank you very much. Yeah. No problem, man. Might pick up some of these. We got Fantastic Four, 544. Love these Jusco covers. It's Champions 15. This Kingpin is really cool. The Kingpin variant from Civil War. And then we got Nightwing, issue 37. Grab these Ultimate Marvel team-ups. First Ultimate Nick Fury. So these are nice $3 grabs. I found two of those. All right, we're hitting gold today. Look what I just found in the Black Panther box. So there's a bunch of cool Black Panther books in here. Bunch of cool different covers. We got some zombies. Joe had it in the box for $3. I got all these really cool Spider-Man books over here. Everything's in really nice really? condition too. That's a really cool Flash. one. Pop Goblin. Pop. So I was looking through this Marvel 2-in-1 box, $3 a piece, and I found two copies of the first Her. That's issue 865. This one's really cool. On, um, what issue is this? Last Rite, 851 from 2009. I got a couple other ones here with Hush, got Catwoman, a bunch of these like deluxe books for $3 a piece. So I got the foil on the penguin and he had a whole stack of these Batman Returns. And I know that these kind of popped up a little bit with the uh, Flash movie news. I don't like the way he's pointing at that thing. The, the, the one you didn't want, the crappy Shrinko. Oh, this? Yeah. Well, uh, probably... You like that because well, he's a... <laughs> <laughs> But I was right, see? He did that, that was his best yeah, work. That's all right. Yeah, that's a cool pickup right there. So did you guys just do a fair trade? I think so. Yeah, we did. He twisted my arm. These are all signed by Jason Muse. Uh, I just gotta, oh, those are signed, those yeah, are pretty yeah. cool. I, I brought some. Very cool. The slabs are nice too. Okay. I just really like the, uh, some of these. Oh, Joe, how much you wanna sell those for? These what? are all the like, facsimiles of number seven. Nothing. They bring me up. Oh, can I read That's a cool one there. Thank you so much. 
All right, so I think we're about done filling up our box with everything. I brought a few hundred dollars with me, so we'll see if Joe could cut us a little bit of a deal. I think he's over here, though, looking at a collection. Let's go see if we can see what he's got. Yeah, well, at least I was glad it wasn't the stuff you bought for me. Yeah, no, that, this, that's this kind of a vicious circle, inventory. don't you think? Yeah, <laughs> so you buy stuff and then bring it back to the same person. Um, to me, that's rude. <laughs> <laughs> that's rude. <laughs> I really didn't like it. Would you like to buy it back? It's all the same kind of stuff, right? Basically. Very similar. Yeah, I mean, it's stuff. It's it's modern. It's newer. It's all clean. <laughs> I like the way you keep saying that. They have bored them back. <laughs> But in a way, you're right. The boards are worth more than the comic. <laughs> I used to pay 12 cents for a comic, right? And then I gave, now it's about 20, something like that. And I said, how I'm paying more for boards and bags now? Than well, I did. From that books. don't make no sense. Of course, yeah. I don't make sense half the time. <laughs> so uh, it sounds kind of close. <laughs> His wife is usually with him. Have you Sarah? ever seen him on YouTube? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I've seen these guys. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. What do you think of me? He didn't say he was good. He just said, I've seen you on YouTube. <laughs> oh, no, I and then now, now he's thanking you before he knows if, <laughs> if he was good or not. Yeah. Gee, I sold every Avengers one, Daredevil one. Yeah, you kind of multiple me. Daredevil ones. You bring me the one. junk, and he sounds <laughs> the good stuff to somebody else. <laughs> uh, my uh, <laughs> What's in here? Maybe just probably some good stuff in here. Let me see. Joe doesn't really know moderns. Oh, I'm it's modern. mostly modern stuff. Yeah. This is the stuff you don't want to take the time to sell on eBay. This yeah, stuff you don't want to take the time to go to the show. <laughs> some modern defenders. Some Doctor Strange. What are you saying? Three long boxes? Yeah, essentially, yeah, yeah. One long box. Yeah. Sure. You said something about that you want to trade? Yeah, if you want to trade. And the only thing is, I don't trade keys for okay junky stuff you know okay so if you want to do that we can do that so, okay uh so what did i tell you hundred dollars long box or something like that yeah that was the cash price right yeah yeah so well, what do you get in a way cash for me you get more but how about giving you i'll give you 400 in trade so 300 in cash 400 or 400 in trade yeah Okay. Now that Joe bought the collection, we're just gonna wait for him to come back, price us out. We'll see what we got our box for. I tried to separate everything so the three dollars. Well, they're in the all front. three, right? Yeah, there's some two dollars in the back there. Oh, well, that's rude. And then here's the keys I got. Right. Some friendly Spider-Man. Oh yeah. Ooh. Ooh, thank you. I know you just got these in, but maybe if I got some money left over, I could put these in the box also. We'd love to come home with these variants. I want to know what all you full-grown men are all doing with these comic books. Collect them, I resell them, I, you know, give them to friends, to my uh, grandson. So how That's much is that reprint? I know, I was going to start collecting oh, Spider-Man I think like grandson. 50 bucks. Yeah. How much is that? There's 600 there. All right, here is our stack of books for 600 bucks. Let me show you guys what we got. These things are pretty awesome. Really nice shape, too. So you have the green two-issue lot. So you have the conclusion. First appearance on this one. Lots of nice sets here. I always love picking up these two issue sets. That's a great cover. Really solid copies on these. And I did have to pick up these Batmans. So we got the whole set here pretty much for Damien. So that was really nice. And then these were a pleasant surprise. Came in with a trade. So I did grab all of these. They're in top loaders. Really nice condition. This thing's pretty sick. This might be one of my favorite pickups of the day. Found this for $3. So that was a nice one. And then I got a whole bunch of these Batmans. The Black Panther. These are really cool. This is a nice little set too. Coming to America part one and two. I got two sets of that. The Black Panther covers are awesome. You gotta love the ones with Storm. Some Peter Parker Spectacular. Got some Hobgoblin. I did get two of these. The iconic Christmas ones. We've got some more spectacular. Always loved this cover here with Electro. Some Marvel team up. These were cool finds too. A little surprised that they had these in the three dollar box because Joe actually had this on the wall for like twenty five bucks. So I got two of those for three dollars a piece. Amazing Spider Man, and then just a bunch of really cool X Men. A lot of Jim Lee covers. 
I've got a couple different duplicates here. Oh, that one's great. Let's see what else we got. Some X Men and Batman. I think I got the set here. Yeah, one through three. Great cover right there. Some clean Batman. Oh, this was another cool one too. Put this one to the side for three bucks. Let's see what else we got. Some Alex Ross Batman. These are great covers here. And then we got Jock. Some Jock covers on Batman. The complete one through four on 10 Nights of the Beast. That's a nice set. Amazing Spider-Man. And then back here are the uh, $2 books. So these are just the $2 Daredevils, some Silver Surfer, and then I got these really cool Ghost Rider books. The rest of the Daredevil. That one was a nice $2 grab. And that's about it. These books for $3 a piece. Can't really get better than that. And then these Damien pickups are really awesome right now. These are really cool. Very happy with today. You guys left a comment down below. What was your favorite book? Oh, these are good. <laughs> we thought we'd, do, we'd try Friday. It turned out really good. $100,000 today. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody. Hit that thumbs up button. Comment down below what your favorite part of the video was. And we'll see you next time.